Previously on Dungeon Man Adventures. I play RuneScape. I have no idea what the fuck is going on. God, I sure do like unlocking Ermor before I go to Daemonheim. It was time to return to the dungeon. Into the dungeon, let's get it. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Now, Jones, you might be thinking, you didn't go and get Herblore done before you went to Daemonheim. And uh, if you said that, first off, shut up. Second off, you would be right. I saw that you could make attack potions, didn't think about the fact that you can't actually make level 3 stuff unless you do the quest, and completely forgot about it. But... I managed to finish the quest without getting any other kind of experience by going to the Dwarven Mines and picking up some gold for the quest, and then going to Entrana to get a free vial. Get the quest done, bing bang boom, back at Daemonheim, no XP gain. And it doesn't really matter that much anyway, because you'll notice throughout this episode I have one herb lore. I don't realize it until the end of this episode. But I might as well go ahead and throw it in there just to explain what happened. But enough of that. Let's get on with the video. Oh. Uh, boss room, I'm prepared. Time to fight the gluttonous behemoth. Seven room floor. Now that's excellent. Five attack? Yeah, imagine. Imagine getting five attack levels in one dungeon. No one else does it. It's, it's uh, specifically me. I'm the kind of guy who gets five attack levels in one floor. That's just what kind of guy I am. All right. Unbalanced party. Oh, what? Another mechanic that I'm very excited to use once again is the bonfire mechanic. Didn't even have to move. We are just zooming on. And by pretty cool, I mean uh, not cool at all. Nice to meet you, buddy. Oh, just kidding, you're dead. you think that I'm not going to fish on these opening levels, you must be out of your mind. Look at all that XP. I am just smoking it, dude. This is what we call progress. It's going to be tough. Once we get outside of this comfort zone, being the intro tutorial levels, which is the first six, complexities one through six. So we're going to want to prepare ourselves the best we can. I know the first thing I'm going to want to make sure that I don't do, increase combat level from woodcutting? I'm sorry? Interesting. Increased combat level from fishing. Yeah, it must be a bug. Um, but anyway, what we're going to want to make sure we do is that we at least balance our melee stats a little bit because there will be a boss at some point down the road that, and I, it's probably multiple. I'm just going to assume it's multiple later on in the game, but I know there's at least one that will switch up its prayer and defend from certain attacks. So we might as well do what we can to prepare ourselves for that. Icy bones. Long time no see, my friend. Must be thinking of somebody else.
Alright, on to the next floor. Glutton. Listen, man. Your boy gotta stay big. Unbalanced party penalty. Yeah, I, I really hope that... 0% I mean, times 98, still 0, I guess. I hope that doesn't affect us in the future. That'd be really unfortunate. Is that all, wait a minute, has that always been like that? That's supposed to be there? I feel like that outline's not really supposed to be there, but maybe it is. Maybe I'm uh, missing something. Range is up to two. It's okay, take your time. Yeah, he just one-shot everything, but that guy was just giving me some trouble. Wait, I already have a... I have a pickaxe? There's tool belts within... Oh, bro. Now, I wonder if Navite has different rate chances based off of like the actual normal ores or if it's just always going to be the same rate chance maybe it's based off the pickaxe who knows all right man try uh try hitting something yeah there you go then just do it again man mark that up that's another ranging level man it really feels like fletching and most skills in general take a lot longer in runescape 3 was fletching arrows this slow in like old school i don't know maybe i'm just losing it oh wow i'm in the tutorial and they gave me a level 50 wood cutting tree now that is pretty cool I guess, to be fair, I've been getting rather lucky with what I can and can't do. So, uh, we'll get used to that. Yeah, there's like, there's no way. If I hop on to old school right now and decide to fletch five pieces of wood, there's no way that it takes 15 seconds. That is just insane. Oh, you can no longer, like, heal while moving, huh? That's alright. That's okay. We'll just, like, waste time. I don't mind. If I did, I wouldn't be playing this, uh, game. Yeah, ranging up to six. Homeward bound. Oh, Heimward bound. Homeward bound. Survivor. We're just too good. Oh, no uh, unbalanced penalty this time? Okay, cool. We'll take it, we'll take it. Smithing armor, hunter. Farming, textiles, crafting, and more shop stock. We're for it. Okay, you know what? The more I, uh, the more I play it, maybe... Maybe the inventory system could be a good idea. I had to walk in here and slap someone up. Oh, they're level seven now? Uh-oh. Level am I? Seven? Yeah, okay. Some salve nettles. It's okay, you can take one whenever you want. Three farming experience. Oh, uh, let's go. 
Do you guys, are you ready for this? Oh, 54 XP. Ooh, so good. Massive XP drop. Absolutely humongous XP drop there. Time for the blue edge door. What do we got behind here? Is that what I think it is? It's a boss. Like a sauce boss going on here. He's done. That was two defense levels just from that. What do you like that? Yeah, so we got ourselves a bunch of uh bunch of cloth. Have to see what we can get. Maybe get a big crafting bust. These post uh post floor areas, like once I finish the floor, this is gonna be where I get a lot of my XP from, so if there's one. There's two. Look at that. Three. Oh my goodness. Berserker, most melee damage. More opportunities within Damon Hen. Complexity five. All right. Let's get it. 27 minutes. <laughs> Gotta get that skilling going, though. All right. We're on a complexity five. Farming seeds, herb lore, thieving, summoning. Complete shop stock, challenge rooms, and skill doors. All right, the game is starting to get real. Getting closer and closer each floor to an actual uh, actual uh, round of Dungeoneering. I'm excited. He kind of looks like me, though. I guess we're going to be doing some range training. Wow, uh, smoked. You cannot interrupt my grind. Ah. Well, that sure is the boss right next to the spawn room. Well, I'm glad that he's in there and we're out here. Well, we got uh, two knives, some pants, and a bunch of crabs. Let's get it. Yeah, we got some defense up. Yeah, we got some proto leather vambrises. Well, now it's time for the uh, post dub skilling, so I'll see you all in a bit. My goodness, I almost forgot. I need to go check on how my potatoes are doing. There it is, up to level six. 1,028, 102 tokens. See, now we're starting to get the real XP. We've gotten everything we need, learned all we need to know how to do, which was not a whole lot. Now it's up to my skills. This will be the first big challenge. Let's roll.